What's up guys, JTails here, and before we get into Elite Smash with Falco, I want to introduce you guys to my new friend, Hubert. You can't see Hubert, but I'm going to show him to you right now. This is Hubert. Hubert's Lemonade. Most of you guys probably don't know this, but lemonade is actually my favorite thing to drink, especially on hot days, and Hubert's came out with a new blueberry lemonade flavor um, that I think you guys should look into. It's brand new and it tastes amazing. Their lemonade isn't too sweet. Um, I usually like to find lemonade that's a little bit more on the sour side, that has like that more lemony kick. And I think that um, Hubert's does a really good job with not putting like too much sugar, so it's not like overly sweet. And it's in a glass bottle, so it doesn't like compromise the flavor of whatever, you know, juice or lemonade is in the bottle. So we're gonna be doing a challenge today, which I'm going to let you guys see my reaction while I'm in between stocks and I'm going to take a sip of some Hubert's Lemonade and you guys can see my reaction whether things are going good or bad on screen. Um, you guys will then get to see my facial expression which I don't usually show. Um, I'm kind of usually behind the screen and you guys just see the game but today's going to be a little different so let's get right into it. And before we jump into that, I'm actually going to open this up and give you guys a candid reaction and flavor tasting for the blueberry lemonade. So let's get to it. I love that sound so much. All right. Here we go. Oh man, it's really good. Yeah, it's perfect. It's like slightly tart, little sweet. Um, I like my lemonade, like I said, on the sour side. So this is actually like the perfect lemonade for me. There's like a blueberry aftertaste. So it's not like, it's not like blueberry juice. It's kind of like lemonade with, with an aftertaste of blueberry. It's pretty interesting. All right, let's get into it for real now. What's up guys, JTails here. You guys already know the deal. One stock equals one sip. Let's get right into it with Falco. All right, and we are going up against Pac-Man, so this is a zoning matchup, and I'm going to really have to use that reflector um, if I want to make things happen here. Pac-Man seems to know what they're doing, so I can't sleep. Yep. Using that hydrant just to get around me. Really smart stuff. Nice grab. Okay, we finally get a bit of damage. I'm trying to make something work here. We do want to try and use up throws against Pac-Man. Okay, a little bit aggressive from off stage. Gonna come right into me. Does not cross me up. Wow. Okay, hits me with the key. Almost. All right, got him on the ropes, chat. Oh, that missed. I'm really surprised that, that missed. All right, here we go. Charging some fruit using that invincibility. It's always gonna be a slow match if you're fighting Pac-Man, guys. Pac-Man really excels at controlling the tempo of the game. Okay, we wanna be very careful with the Galaga. Pac-Man's primary tool for racking up damage. And I'm going to just reflect that key right back at him. Okay, punish the ledge option. 
Hit him, make him drop his orange. A back air sh- Ooh! Giving up, I see. <laughs> Guys, we got a rage quitter. We got a rage quitter. Looks like he's just kind of giving up all hope. Not really sure what, what he's doing, but... Definitely not playing uh, controlled or confident at all. Kind of just looks like he wants to get this over with. No more hydrant. No more fruit. Just kind of r rushing at me now. Doesn't seem to be too interested in playing the zoning game. What? I've never seen that before. Waiting for Hydrant. Friend request received. So, not only did they almost cancel out of the match, but then they sent me a friend request? Moderately confused, but GG's. Down to run it back if they are. Still moderately confused, but we definitely do end up taking them down. And they dip out. Ooh, jumping right back into it. We have a Pichu, okay. So, this matchup's gonna be interesting. Um, not sure how Pichu versus Spaceys go, but I'd imagine that they might have a little bit of trouble with the offstage game against Pichu. But, nice backer out of shield, really solid stuff. Another back air. Lance has some really good um, defensive maneuvers. Those back airs out of shield in particular. Nope. Misses the jab lock setup. Stash attack. Gonna go high here. Don't want to uh, um, actually get caught by Pichu. Ooh, almost got the punish there on the landing gonna shoot a laser can actually see the difference in hurt box size looking for that two frame on the forward tilt it's definitely real up throw no combo and we are going to take another stock. The drag down back air takes it. No punish on the landing. We have to contest his uh, his full hop thunder jolts in order to win this. And the two frame takes it. Down for the run back.
Huh, no one sticks around anymore, huh? That's interesting. Day, day, day. DDD, depending on where you're from. All right, let's get right into this. Heavy versus Falco. I think Falco does a really good job in this matchup. Um, I think DDD can become combo food for him, and well, that's a lot of damage. And he can reflect the Gordos, right? So it kind of gives Falco a pretty big advantage um, in terms of racking up damage and avoiding neutral tools. You can just kind of stuff him for doing that. Okay, gonna jump with the uh, neutral B. So again, we can kind of just block that on reaction. Up throw. Up air does get the dodge. No back air out of shield. Not gonna hit. We do get to avoid the hammer though, which is pretty nice. Yep, and that is gonna be the first stock. Looking for the jet hammer. Back hit of the up smash. Not the strong hit. How did that get sent back at me? Okay, that back air is not going to take it yet. Maybe a forward air would have been a better option there. But we are going to get it here. I'm done to run it back. Okay, looks like he might be sticking around. Let's see if he wants to play again. Have a friendly rematch. We have a Link player. Another Japanese tag, it seems. Um, dark costume. Curious to see how this one's gonna go. We did have a Pac-Man player that was also in a uh, Japanese name tag. I'm just wondering as to how accurate that may be. Okay. Player definitely understands neutral and safe moves. Up throw, can we get the follow up? Yes we do. I'm actually going to go to the left, or sorry, to the right, just to avoid any potential setups. Too early on the forward smash on my part. Okay, good up air. Really greedy with that up B! Oh. 
Nice up out of shield. Not quite yet. Another one. Still living though. Nice timing. Really good edge guarding. Sub smash. Really reliant on that up B. So what we're gonna have to do is not hit this link shield when we're above him. We're gonna have to be a little bit more respectful in that situation. Nah. I'm getting out of here. That's a punish. Nice read on the jump. Wow, I'm surprised that didn't connect. Really surprised that didn't fully connect. Unfortunate for me. Wow, boomerang protecting him. No attack on your shield, buddy. I know that's what you're looking for. Oh, I'm down to run it back. That was a really, really intense and very well played match. And he dips. Story of my life. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. I would greatly appreciate that. And consider subscribing to the channel. Also, check the description for location of Hubert's near you. There are going to be links in the description for that. Yeah, so consider giving it a try if you haven't done so yet. I would greatly recommend it, and I will see you all next time.